like the poison is moving. I don't know what it is. Promise to always be loyal and tell you the truth. I ain't never gonna lie to your face. Mama. That's my man. Baby woke me up. She said, baby, my lips. I'm having an allergic reaction. I look at her, her bottom lip is like completely swollen. Come on. But that is all I see when I first got up. And it's still a little swollen, mm -hmm. see? But she has hives all over. See it a little bit. First of all, on your arm. Right here. This whole area right here. Oh, there we go. Right there. So she has One like right these here. hives. Right here. It looks, doesn't look as bad because I took a Benadryl a yeah, couple she hours. Just, yeah, she took an hour ago. Yeah, about an hour ago, but. Baby was panicking because she is a panicker. It's because the lips. Oh, here, show my yeah. ankles though. My ankles are the crazy part. See Look right at that. Here. That thing is huge. Focus it. Oh, you can see it in the light. Oh, yeah. Huge. That one, and it's, I have it in the same exact spot on the other ankle, which is crazy right here. And then yesterday, I, um, Woke up with the same kind of, like kind of, but it was like more, it was bumps on my arm. I don't know if you can see it. Bumps on my arm. But they were really, really, really big and flat. Not as circular as these. I realized now watching this back, I was scratching my neck, my fingers were swollen and my entire face was swollen. I could see it in my eyelids. Everything was swollen. It just wasn't as drastic as it was when I had woken up. But the lip, that's what scared me. You know, if your lips swell up, like what? My face? You coming for my face? Yeah, my lip is, oh my gosh. It is so big still. And it's only on this one side. See, look, it's all this right here. Whew. I actually went to pee. I was looking at my arms just to make sure I didn't have any new and then I saw it right here on this part of my arm and I was like then my ankles was itching a little bit I took the side it was itching I was like oh I'm getting a bump there and then I looked in the mirror she was you know, I was, me. You was scary I was so scared you were being crazy. I was panicked you were definitely panicking my tongue started to feel like it was swelling up. My throat never swelled up, so that's good. I don't know, I never had a reaction. So we, I, we are thinking that it's from, um, <laughs> I am tired. <laughs> Just almost fell asleep like that, did <laughs> Oh, whoa. Stop fighting it, come on. Um, we were thinking that it was from something on the sheets or something, but we think it's now probably from Justice Cleanse or Something I'm eating, I don't know, we'll figure it out. I have had, been having a lot of watermelon, but I don't wanna be allergic to watermelon because I love watermelon. It's so good. I'm gonna have to take a Benadryl anytime I wanna take a, eat watermelon. That's not fun. So, yeah, that's what I'm currently going through. So, yeah, this Benadryl is hitting me. I'm a little sleepy now. But it was really scary. You would not imagine, bae, how scary it was to go through an allergic reaction. I've never been through a allergic reaction. I ain't allergic to nothing. So that was just really scary. Really, really scary. So hopefully everything goes down. I should have grabbed the camera and recorded me in my panic mode, but you never really had a camera going right when you need it. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, so here we are. Hopefully my lip goes down soon. It is a lot better than what it was because it was hanging. It was like this. So, yeah. Pray for me. Put it in the comment section. Encourage your words. Let me know if y'all have experienced a allergic reaction because it's very scary. It's been a drill time.
my lips, both my lips are swollen. This right here and my bottom lip is very swollen. And uh, my nose, the bulb of my nose right here is swollen. I feel like my ears are swollen at the bottom. I thought all oh, the swelling would be gone, gone down when I woke up, but it's still swollen. And I already took one of these new Benadryls. Baby want me to take another one. They're clear Benadryls. She wants me to take another one. Take, be really drowsy. I'm not gonna get no work done today. I'll keep updating you throughout the day. Hopefully I can come back with some good words about how I feel good. Cause we don't want to, I don't want to eat something that it may be, I'm trying to see if it could clear up by not eating anything that I've really been eating in the past couple days. I'm just going to eat things that my body is used to. No fruit. So I won't have watermelon or oranges cause that's what I've added more recently. Oh, I had cherries last night and we had these new olives. So I have to, I can't have those either. Ugh, it's no fun. This is no fun. Like the poison is moving. I don't know what it is. My lips got bigger. I just need to circulate. Manage it up. I'm gonna um, get you an ice pack. Okay? I don't know why I won't go down. Gotta give it time. It's not gonna happen that fast. <laughs> You know, mom said that it's gonna take a minute. <sighs> Breathe. Breathe, babe. <sighs> Come here. It hurt. It's just big. Yeah. Like it hurt bad or is it like is it like it's full. Yeah. I don't know, baby, I think that um I think that you they hot weaning off at least maybe at least give you some soup. Something. This side of my face is swollen. My top lip was never even swollen. It was just my bottom earlier today. Okay, let me make you some. Um, I made the decision that I feel like I need to go to urgent care or the ER because my lips are just exchanging the fluid or poison or whatever it is right now so because they didn't got so much bigger i want to go also my face is my face is all around swollen but you can see right here there's one bump on my eye right here is a little high i guess uh it's like one or two right here right there so for those reasons, I'm gonna go. And then I feel like it's just like, my skin feels a bit, I can just feel, I feel stuff inside of me. I don't know what it is. Like, I feel swollen. And my legs feel a little weak. I um try to like, you know, just standing up, I'm kind of like off balance. Remember I told you I was dancing yesterday? I felt really off balance. I felt really off balance last night, so I didn't know what it was from, so I'm just gonna go. My family is amazing, and you know, they gave me a lot of things to kind of do, and I'm gonna do those things, but I don't like feeling like I don't know what's going on, and so it's important for me, myself, 
to go and see if somebody can tell me what's going on. And then I'll also do the necessary herbal stuff. But this was not what I expected to happen today. Did they go down? They feel like they went down. So. The bottom lip, not the upper lip. No. Hmm. Hey guys. I'm at the hospital. We're gonna see what they end up doing. My lip is still swollen, but it's not as bad as it was. It's also a hive, some hives in my face and in my eye, so. And my face is kind of swollen too, so. We'll see what happens. They just sent me up to this monitor. I got really sad and scared a couple hours ago, so <sighs> everything's gonna be okay. I am strong. I am resilient. I am healthy. So the doctor's gonna give me a IV with steroids and Pepsi to hopefully decrease the inflammation in my face and make that go away because this, this is not it's not it I wasn't gonna take it I was gonna do it orally but he said since I'm here I might as well do it you see those two right there there's one right here here and a couple of my cheeks but I feel like I should do that. Ooh, this thing is squeezing my arm. Anyway, so that's what I'm working with now. My check back in with y'all. Sucks. Somebody fighting. It's a drug and they're telling him they gotta leave and they're trying to kick him out. Like, F I can't see it. I'm sorry. Ooh, y'all busy. Um, I might just take the, the pills. That's fine. If you send the prescription in, oh, yeah, I'll just can. take it. You don't want that. Well, I, I, I did order the IV. I'm sorry. This is the busiest I've been in about five years. Yeah, it's, I don't know what happened today, but I guess no one wants to enjoy fireworks. It sounds like crazy in here. I see that you are yeah. busy. And I'm the only person here. Oh, I was no. supposed to have help, but they called out sick. Oh. I suspect because they wanted to see fireworks. That's that's fucked up, though. You're, you've been feel. doing amazing, though. I appreciate it. <laughs> um, um, I think you are okay, so if you don't want the idea, I think it's reasonable. Okay. Um, uh, I, will, uh, I will order... A pill, the prednisone now, so we can start it now. Okay. Then the rest of the medicines can be in the morning. Okay. How long you um? Oh, okay, let me ask a question. We I take the steroid. Should I still take Benadryl or the steroid would? Yeah. So it? it's steroids, Benadryl, and Pepsi. All in one. Take, yeah. Well, the, the the steroid is 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 um uh twice a day, and the. I'm sorry, the steroid is once a day, the Benadryl is four times a day, the Pepsi is twice a day. Okay. Yeah, I'll the write it all down for you. Okay, gotcha. Um, and I can start it immediately after I get it? Well, I can, yes, okay. um, unless you want me to give you your first dose of prednisone here, and then you, you can do the rest tomorrow. Oh, yeah, that sounds great. Okay, yeah, okay. all right. Thank sounds you, thank you. I appreciate you. Sorry for the, the delay. Oh, it's okay. Oh, I was recording. I just had a bump come up right here. Yeah, I can see. Hmm. 
Okay, I was like, I really don't think y'all are allowed it, but I mean, you can wake my most bitch ass up in the fucking parking lot if you want. Okay, I love you. I don't think I'll let you in, but thank you. I love you. I'm a face look. This is swollen everywhere. Look at my nose, it's so swollen. <sighs> this girl next to me slid down a water slide with a bunch of people and they all fell on top of her. She broke her ribs and her lung collapsed. But she's still talking, she's so drunk, she is cussing. It's so much going on in this hospital. They just had to put out a man who um, was homeless. Like they had to put him out of the hospital. He got a little aggressive. It's so much, so much going on. I'm just ready to go home. Yeah. Hopefully things get better. Hey y'all. Ooh. I just got home from the hospital. They did give me a um steroid called prednisone. I'm pretty sure that's what they gave me. To help with the swelling. My lip is still swelling. Not as bad as it was before though. My face is still swollen. You can kind of see it right there on this side of my eye. And then a little bit up here in my nose is swollen. Other than that, I really don't have too many new bumps. I just feel it like in my body, which is not fun. So I'm really hoping this stuff helps because I don't like nothing to mess with my face. I really don't. Mm -mm. No. <sighs> so, yeah, I was going to do an IV there, but it was just taking too long. It was going to probably take another hour or two for them to finally give me an IV with the medicine in it. So I decided to just take the tablets. Um, and, yeah, they're really fucking nasty. If you ever had to take prednisone or any kind of steroid, it is disgusting. Yeah. I really hate that my lips are swollen like this though, so. I'm about to jump in the shower. I got out of my hospital clothes, you know. Gotta get all those germs off me from being in the hospital. I'm gonna take a shower, get clean. Hopefully eat something and maybe try to feel a little bit better. I probably gotta take another Benadryl, which is gonna make me more sleepy. I've just been sleeping all day. So, hopefully, it gets better. We'll see. Hmm. All right. I love y'all. This is crazy. i never been through nothing like this before, ever in my life. Never have I ever had a allergic reaction like this. So, i am got to figure out what's going on, why, or what is causing it. So, that's going to be my next um, thing to do. Hey, guys. So this is our meal for the evening. Pepper is stuffed with avocado um, that's seasoned and has cilantro on it with some tomatoes, onions. Some of uh, babies have jalapenos. And that's what we have for dinner. It's the first time we stuffed some peppers, so that's pretty cool. I'm feeling a little bit better. My lips have went down more. They still are swollen, but it's a lot better than it was. Mmm. I'm gonna take some Benadryl probably in about a hour. It's gonna put me to bed. And I'm just praying that I wake up and I don't <laughs> not swollen anymore. All right, I stopped eating watermelon and oranges because those have been the newest things that I included into my diet. And um, I wanna see if that's what's causing it. So I'm gonna slow down on that. I'm not gonna have any for a couple days and then start again and then see if that's what causes this then i'll know if i'm allergic to any of those things i look a lot better than i did earlier i know that's for sure <sighs> hey babe so 
what a day my lips were really still swollen but they look basically be back to normal now which is amazing because i was freaked out okay i was freaked out i did not like my lips being that swollen it was scary okay um i did take prednisone they gave me three 175 tablets and those are 20 milligrams each but they gave me that amount because they i guess felt like it was severe because my face was swelling up so basically oh, before i go to sleep i am going to take i'm probably gonna take it now two more benadryls and my upper lip is still a little swollen as you can see it's still a little swollen um but all the hives on my body pretty much gone like they went away totally my skin looks back to normal yep i had a new one that came up on my arm that one's gone all the redness is gone when i did get home my skin was very red like red like i could see it, it looked like like oranges and red underneath but that has all subsided now my feet are basically, I still have a little bump here and a little one right there, but my feet are basically back to normal. So, you all see where those highs were. I'm not sure what it's from. I'm gonna take a break. No watermelon, no oranges for um, another day. And then when I know that I'm back to normal, I will then reintegrate them and I'm gonna see if it gives, causes me to have a reaction, then I can know what it is that's causing me to be allergic to it. One thing I learned today, they said that you only get allergic reactions normally overnight. That's when, I guess when, I guess when your body is relaxed is when everything can like do whatever it's needed to do and that's when you wake up with an allergic reaction. It's normal to get it throughout the night and it to come up overnight. Um, now obviously, you do get allergic reactions to food, but yeah, that's what they said. I just wanted to give y'all an update, say I love you, thank you for the well wishes, cause I know y'all gonna put some well wishes in the comments. And um, yeah, hopefully everything gets better. That was so scary, so crazy. How, how over time the edema, the inflammation, and stuff and the reactions went to different parts of my body that was like nuts to me so i'm just happy i bet i'm better because i was panicked okay panicked. anyway i love you i love you babe i'll talk to you tomorrow i might make this a whole i might make this just one video so if so then you'll see that so if so make sure you like comment and subscribe to my channel i love you this it. Bye. Why the heck am I still awake? It's 4.30 in the morning. My lips are officially back to normal. Which is great. Oh, it feels so good to have nice lips again. Um, but that prednisone ain't a joke. Prednisone really do make you have a lot of energy. You can only only take that thing, they only take that in the morning. Unless you have to. And I guess I had to so that I could, you know, be like this, not swollen. Um, but yeah, I did take a Benadryl at 2 a.m. But that thing was not making me sleep. I took only took one. So I just took another one about 25 minutes ago, 30 minutes ago, something like that. And it's hitting now. I'm about to go to sleep. I'm sleepy now. I'm just praying that after I go to sleep, I won't wake up with anything inflamed so i'm gonna keep y'all updated i love you so much we all figure this out together so yeah let's go